I'm going to do a little quick video here on something with Windows 8 that I want to show you. And if you're someone that likes to mess around with the Windows features and perhaps change the Windows startup sound if you decide to enable it, there's a little something I want to show you here that you need to be aware of. We're currently loading Windows 8 right now, and you'll hear the new startup sound when Windows loads. Now that's actually the Windows Vista Beta 2 startup sound. I changed it on here with an application that winarrow.com provided. But I'm going to log into Windows 8 here and this is what I want to show you. See it logs into the Metro screen normally but look at the Metro screen, it's messed up. And if I'm scrolling back and forth the metro, metro screen doesn't work properly. And if I try going to the desktop, well, if I go to the desktop, the screen's totally blank, and I can't do anything. Now you may be thinking, oh, maybe this is probably that a vast antivirus problem people are having. No, this is something entirely different. So, and I discovered that this does happen when you change the Windows startup sound. So... My advice is just don't do it. That's why I wanted to make this whole video because I had this problem to system restore. It fixed it and then I tried changing the sound again and it did this again. So that's why I wanted to show that. So if you got Windows 8 and you're using the startup sound but are thinking of changing it, don't do it because you can end up having this particular problem.